your brain. So I don't know was Mary telling you this one came in feral basically we couldn't get our hands on her on her at all um in that she was never um never handled by people because they generally if they've even if they've been beaten they're easier than this because they've had some socialization with people even if it's been bad so she's been six months in a home and we've gone no further Oh yeah, she gets to handle her and brush her and everything, which is worlds away from where we were. But our next one is to get a lead on her, and we can't for love nor chicken. <laughs> but we have to get her on lead for her to progress out of Mary's home <laughs> and into the wild, wider world. Mary is fostering her. And this is what we do. <laughs> Luckily, this morning I got a dog walker, a volunteer, came out to help me out um, because I needed to be cleared up by 11 o'clock because um, somebody was coming out to, uh, to get their dog trained and that was 11 o'clock but while they were here and I was training their dog somebody came to collect a dog um, that they had adopted which is always nice but of course while he was here another person arrived looking for a dog um, um, looking for a dog so they needed to be shown around the place and and they needed to see appropriate dogs that they they would like and of course the dog warden arrived in the middle of all of that as well <laughs> so um, and he had two male dogs I have no space um, and he was looking for I literally had nowhere to put the dogs be 10 hours here on my own on a Friday and not see a single human being and you saw today it's just heaven with people but anyway I'm a teacher by trade and that sometimes still calls to me but I always end up coming back here I did have last year I suppose kind of just decision time in my life that I, I had a couple of decisions to make about moving back to Dublin or not um, that's where I'm from and I chose to stay here, and a huge reason for staying here would be Madra. I'm tied to it now, you know, we started this and you kind of have to see it through. So yeah, I would never get the same enjoyment out of teaching them teenagers that uh, I do out of the dogs, really, you know. And you walk away, job done, it's amazing. <laughs>